here with Diego Magdaleno, Jesse Magdaleno, brothers, upcoming talent in the boxing game, two of Las Vegas' top, you know, fighters coming up. Uh, guys, big changes for you last year. You know, you guys are now with uh, Joel Diaz uh -huh. down in his, uh, his hotbed of boxing down here in Indio. I mean, tell me each about your guys' year. You know, how was 2013? Um, you know what? It, it was good. It started out a little rough for me, um, you know, especially uh, my first loss. Yeah. But, um, you know, as um, the year went on, it just turned into something great, you know, because yeah. now with uh, uh, Joel Antonio and our coach Jose Rodriguez, who's uh, helping us also, um, it, it's a big, a, big, a big difference now, knowing from where I was to now where I am, mm -hmm. you know, and, and 2014 is going to be, it's going to be crazy. Gotcha. And me, um, 2013 was my year. Um, I went all out. Um, I fought four times and we came with the W. Yep. And um, I prospect got prospect of the year, prospect of the year, okay. prospect of the month. Um, it was a good year for me. Got you. Now, how, how how much is life different from when you guys first started boxing and started making a little bit of noise in Vegas? Now you guys are really starting to ring. Your name's starting to ring bells a little bit. Um, you know, it's, it's it's nice, especially when we fight here at home. We haven't fought here at home in uh in a minute, and uh, I hear um, um, uh, you know, April might be another you know home hometown crowd uh, favorite okay. going at it again. Okay. So April, we we're, we're on uh February, February uh. I think the middle of February. Yeah. And then, um, you know, everything's going to go great. Would, then April is going to be Would that be like here. around the Pacquiao card, like the night before, one of those deals? It might be something like that, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Now, tell me about Joel Diaz. Just what was it like when you first came to him? You know, a new trainer is always going to be an adjustment. What was it like coming coming to him? Well, a lot of people don't know, but I, when, we, when we spoke to uh, Frank, you know, he mentioned uh, Abel Sanchez. And then uh, he brought up Joe Diaz, and um, you know these are guys with with talent. You know, yeah. they they know their craft. They, they they've been in the game, and um, they're um, you know they know the business, and that's that's they have the experience. That's what I was looking for. So uh, going into that, uh, as soon as we we uh, we met with uh, Joe Diaz, I've known him from you know before, mm -hmm. but as soon as we we got in there, it was an instant connection. Yeah, what what. Oh me, he just was open arms with me. I know Antonio since um, since amateur years, and yeah. we've been together. We talked, and uh, just going to him was just like yeah. just, it was very a natural welcoming. move, huh? Yeah. Now yeah. tell me about him. Just if you take me behind the scenes, just the way that Jim is, the way he teaches. Like, what's camp like down there? Um, it's very professional. You know, yeah. that's the first thing that uh, everything's organized. Um, we do everything for a reason, not just to do it. And that right there, um, I think, is one of the, the best things uh, going for us right now. You know, yeah. we have yeah. it, we have a plan, a set plan. Yeah, it's always it's always uh, it's never the same thing every day. Every mm -hmm. day is something different. We're either doing legs, we're doing upper body, we're doing you know conditioning, and oh, it, it's always all planned. And and <laughs> what what advice does he offer you? Like, just you know, t what's he tell you about his game, his stories in the sport, everything? Oh, oh he, he, everything from. If you guys know Joel Diaz, and, you know they got stories for days. They have a lot of experience. They've they've been in the game for for so long, and they can tell you they can tell you uh, so many stories on you know been in the ring and out of the ring. Got you. Now, your guys, uh, you guys are all definitely close, and you know your younger brother, you know coming up, Mark. Um, he, it's like the three of you. Don't you guys kind of stay together down there? You have like camp life together. I mean, what's that like being brothers, but you're all fighters too. Well, ever since we were little, we've always been together, and yeah. uh, nothing's gonna change. That's why Jesse decided to, uh, you know, come with Big Brother after, you know, the whole deal with, you know, yeah. I don't want to say any names, but everyone knows. Um, okay. So I brought him along, and he knew um, there was uh, gonna be better for him, and um, y you know, here we are. Yeah. You know? and I had two fights with Joel already, and uh, they've been great, and I've never felt better th with him than um, than I did before, and and now I know it's just gonna be continue, just to keep growing.